Many illegal Roblox bearers hacks have been going around on YouTube and TikTok, and I'm gonna see if they're real or fake. Also, at 300k, I'll give away 30 kits in my Discord server, so consider subscribing. It's free, and it helps a ton. The first hack we have can apparently create a block stronger than Bedrock. I don't see how that's possible, but let's watch then test it. So he starts by placing a wool block, then puts CNT above it, and now he's breaking the block. So basically, he just broke the wall when the TNT exploded. It looks like the block is unbreakable. Now we're gonna test this hack to see if it's real or fake. Place the wall, place the TNT. And yup, the wall is literally unbreakable, which means this hack is real. But can you make a bet defense of this? So I repeated the hack 8 times to cover my bed. And yup, the bed is unbreakable. But if you thought that was cool, the second hack we have can apparently make you unkillable. So the video shows someone blending in with the shopkeeper, which blocks your hitbox, making them unkillable. To expose this hack, I'm gonna head right over here. So yeah, he can't hit me with a sword, which means this hack is real. But if you're smart enough, you would probably use a boat to counter this glitch. Now this next one shows that the flamethrower can burn through wood. I guess that Bedwars is copying the real world. So I got my flamethrower and I'm gonna burn this wood. Somehow the blocks do not burn. Now I would call this fake, but my flamethrower has zero upgrades. And I can't physically upgrade it because I don't have pyro. So like any person would do, I'm gonna contact a dev. So I'm gonna take the dev's word and say this hack is real. And the video itself looks pretty legitimate and not faked. But we're gonna expose some actual fake ones later on. This next one features an apple clutch. So he is standing on a tower. And his friend slaps him off as he chucks the apple. And he barely survived the fall. I think what he did was take damage from his friend, then heal up for some extra health. I found this hack by getting a notification when he tagged me in the title. So if you wanna be in these videos, be sure to add hashtag cubic in the title. Now it's time for a height check. Place a TNT. And yup, that kills me. But now it's time for the real apple clutch. And I barely survived. I guess that worked. So if you get hit off a cliff, be sure to chug an apple for a chance of surviving. In better words, of course. So this hack is real. Apparently with this next hack, you can get full emerald in just a matter of seconds. Which sounds pretty illegal. The first step is to get two emeralds. Drag the item, press Q and release click. And now he's actually doing it. So this man just went from 10 to 12 emeralds in a few seconds. Step 1, get 2 emeralds. And there we go. Drag the item, press Q, and release click. Looks like I still have 2 emeralds. I just realized in the pinned comment, he said it's patched. So this hack is fake. But don't worry, because there are many more hacks that we have to cover. So this video shows a way to get a wider hit range. Just get 2 swords and switch between them while attacking. So here's me and here's my friend. We are 5 blocks apart which is just out of reach. We're gonna try this hack and... I kinda expected that to not work. So this hack is fake. If you really want more reach, buy the ninja animation. The next hack claims that Bedwars added world edit, where you can basically build a million blocks in a second. Bedwars added world edit, well it's kinda scuffed. What do you mean by that? So he types in the command, we're gonna pause that. So with this command, you can fill as many blocks as you want. Slash edit flat bedrock 10. And we place about 100 blocks in a second. But let's push the limits of the command. Slash edit flat bedrock 100. And I'm having a huge ping spike. I mean, what do you expect? 10,000 blocks in a matter of seconds. Now that is insane. You can build a whole map of this. But let's try 1,000. By running that command, the game will completely break. And some of the blocks will spawn outside the map. But yeah, this hack is real. Roblox recently added a free emote called the Burberry Lola. Which gives you free fly hacks. The emote is currently off sale. But if you have it, get ready for this next hack. This emote is very pay to win. But how can it be pay to win if it's free? So apparently, you can use this emote to no clip out of walls. I think. So I'm trapped in this glass box with no way out. But according to Horseman Dan, the glitch master himself, I can somehow slide out from below with this emote. And yup, I just slid out. This emote can be used to not only fly, but also maneuver your way out of traps, which means this hack is real. Now let's expose some TikTok hacks. A whole other side of the game. Secret hiding spot glitch. I'm pretty good at finding hiding spots, but I have never seen this one before. This hiding spot is illegal. Well, that is perfect for this video. Slash cube on iron gen. And he gets glitched above. Now that is a chungus. Jump off the map to respawn. Well, you can just reset. And he's repeatedly suffocating. That's funny. Wait till you get pushed under spawn. And now he's digging towards some sort of secret room room. They will never know. I mean, they will know after this video. If this hack is real, this only works in the Aztec map. Slash keep on iron gen, get glitched above, and reset. And now I'm just getting suffocated. I'm gonna wait this one out. 
many suffocations later, I'm not getting pushed down to the secret area, so I'm gonna call this one fake. So this next one starts off with a very funny pun. So he's spawning a grappling hook and puts himself to negative one health. And he's grappling. Wait, what? He's literally getting ragdolled. Like, what even is this? So there are two steps to achieve this power. Step one, spawn a grappling hook. Step two, set your health to negative one. And we should be good to go. Right off the bat, we're just taking off in the sky. I expected this to be patched, but I guess it works. So this hack is 100% real. Don't tell the devs about this. Well, I'm just gonna... So with this hack, you can crash people's games. Use a chair emote, then spectate and swap teams. It duplicates. You can crash games have done loads. So basically, you go on spectator team, spawn a chair by pressing T with the beach vacation emote, switch your team and repeat. So I spawned a handful of chairs, but I am experiencing zero lag. But technically, if you spawn enough entities, you will start to lag. I think this applies to chairs as well. So this hack is probably real. The best bet defense in Bedwars history. This better be a good one. So there's lucky airdrops falling down. Place Tesla where lucky block lands. Now you have infinite Tesla traps. I think I saw this glitch before, but I never thought of using it as a bet defense. Of course, the airdrops are on the other side of the map. Now if I carefully align it... Now I can place infinite tesla traps, but let's test it on our bed defense. So it's safe to say, this hack is real. Another crazy glitch in Roblox Bed Wars. This better be the craziest glitch in the book. First, spawn a bunch of dodos and mount them all. Let's go, an epic time lapse. When you start jumping, you should jump super high. So this somehow gives you a jump boost. So I'm gonna spawn a small amount of dodos, and all I gotta do is mount a bunch of them. So we mounted 20 dodos, and we're jumping a little higher because we're floating. So if you get enough dodos in a public game, you can do this hack, which is real. Now this next one is actually one of my TikToks from almost a year ago. Roblox Bedwars and their pearls are literally broken. I mean, they kinda are. So I jump off the ship and pearl into a secret area. I wonder if it still works today. Well, let's try it. And I pearled into this room, which isn't the same room as the one in the video. Probably because the ship has been changed over time. So this hack is fake. But there are more hiding spots that you can find with telepearls. Like this one, this one, and especially this one. This next hack is probably the most illegal one yet. Fall damage is disabled for everyone. Now that is weird. This glitch removes fall damage and it's pretty easy. This is what you need to do. You just switch between tools. So he's building up, right? Then jumps off and switch tools. And takes no fall damage. I hope this one doesn't fail. Like the last hack that requires you to switch tools. So I'm gonna jump. Switch tools. And zero fall damage. That is what I like to see. You only need two items and two fingers for this hack. Which is real. We exposed a total of 15 illegal hacks. But there's one more I want to test. And that is if we can hit 300k this year. So check if you are subscribed. It takes two seconds and it helps me a ton. And if this gets 20,000 likes, I'll do more of these videos. But for now, that's a wrap.